Good morning, everyone. It's day three, Saturday. Um, Saturday morning, I'm going to go up and see what the breakfast looks like here at the Breakers. I think they said it's on the fourth floor, and it's a self-serve breakfast. So I'm going to go up and take a look and take you with me. And then I'll check in later. I was right. As you can see, I'm on the elevator. The breakfast room is four. The pool is on five. So, yes. Going to the breakfast room. There's a restaurant here, too. I'm going in. This is the breakfast. Okay, I came in here early. It opens at eight, and it's like a little after seven, so I'll be back in an hour. But while I'm here, let's go up and see what the pool area looks like. So we're on the fifth and top level. This is what it looks like up on the fifth level. We're gonna go to the pool. This is a view, beautiful morning here in Delaware. Walking around to the pool area. Okay. Looking for the pool. Here's the pool. The pool's open from nine to nine, so I can't get in here either. So it's locked. So it's saying it's closed for technical issues. So this is the pool area. What I can see. Alrighty. So. It looks as if it's not going to be open either way. But they do have a pool here. I don't know if it's closed for the season or whatever, but they have one. It's just closed. I'm going down the steps. Once again, view of bubble hair and the convention center is over there. And I'm walking down the steps because that elevator, you only have one elevator and it's too slow. So, well lit. Stairways well lit, clean. Okay. So good morning again, everyone. I am out on the balcony area of our room here at the Breakers Hotel and Suites here, and I just want to do look over i'm overlooking our balcony it's like a nice picnic area across a little park area green area and that's nice i always like to stay on this side because you get that green area as opposed to the other side that has a parking garage and as i said here are the that's what it looks like so we usually just sit out here just chill um people are riding their bikes this morning it's just a nice beautiful morning um, so as I said, I'm gonna, we're gonna go back up to the breakfast room when it opens at eight and show you what they have for breakfast. And after that, Q and I are gonna put some clothes on and we're gonna mosey around the beach and see the shops here and give you a little bit of that. Um, usually shops close around um, when off season comes here, but here they stay open and I think it's because of the jazz festival or any other events they have here. So we're just gonna walk along the um, boardwalk here in Rehoboth and just give you a sense of, of what it's like here today is a beautiful day we've been here before when it was rainy we've been here before when it was really cold so today it's about 60 70 degrees which is really nice for october so as i said we're gonna go get get a bite eat, to eat breakfast um take you with us go out just uh do a little walking uh tour around rehoboth and bring you that so you kind of get a vibe for rehoboth
so we're back in the room and this is the breakfast the eggs the bacon the croissant and they had little waters and orange juice and i got tea as you know you don't know i'm a tea person i don't care for coffee uh they also had cereal um that you, and milk and coffee uh and apples and condiments so pretty decent breakfast you know i would say for um here at the breakers Hello everyone, it's Saturday morning, um, we went to see Damien Escobar and Eric Darius last night, that show was phenomenal, Damien Escobar was phenomenal, he's a jazz violinist and if you get a chance to see him, please see him, he did great covers of a lot of popular songs, he was just really really good, uh, put some clothes on and go around um, Rehoboth and just do a quick tour of Rehoboth, uh, and tonight there's another show, but we have to go to uh, Cape Henlon uh, High School for this show. It's an all-star jazz show. It has Nicole Leone and Mesa and various jazz artists. So we're excited about that. So stay with us and we hope that you are enjoying this vlog and if you choose to go to the Rehoboth Jazz Festival or any jazz festival next year, we just want to give you some, um, some insight and some behind the scenes on the jazz festivals that we attend. Uh, we enjoy jazz and um, we just hope you enjoy this vlog. So, as always, we ask you to subscribe, like, and comment. Um, comment on what jazz festivals you've gone to this year or which ones that you prefer. Um, maybe make some suggestions of jazz shows that maybe Q and I can go to. And then we'll take you along on our tour for Hope today. We are walking down Rehoboth Avenue. Different shops and stores here. And Rehoboth Beach is pet friendly. It's a pet friendly community.
So Q and I have walked around to um, around Rehoboth. We um, showed you some footage before this. And needless to say, it is the off season, but a lot of the stores and shops are open. Some of them are closed for the season. Uh, it's a nice day today, so a lot of people have been down at the beach. And um, this community is a nice, inclusive community. It's pet friendly. And it's um, <laughs> And it has a lot of, um, you know, it's just a nice community to vibe in and to come enjoy a relaxing weekend of jazz. So uh, we hope you enjoyed our little walking tour of Rehoboth and um, we're probably going to go back to the room and chill for a little bit and get ready for the show this evening. If we decide to do something else, I'll pop that in. But as always, thanks for watching. We hope that you've enjoyed so far our Rehoboth weekend adventure and that it is encouraging you, no matter where you are, to maybe come to Rehoboth for a weekend of jazz. Hello, good evening everyone. We are on our way to the Rehoboth Beach Jazz Fest Rehoboth Beach Jazz Festival Saturday evening all-star show featuring um, Nick Coleone and Mesa and a lot of the other jazz artists. So we have to go up to the um, Cape Henlin High School Performing Arts, which is up the road. It's about, I guess, a 10-minute drive. So we have to get in the car and go up. It's a little rainy, but everything's cool. So Q and I are on our way up. Hopefully we can bring you some footage of that. And um, we're on our way. And as always, thanks for watching. <laughs> peace, you got something to say quick? Nope, peace. Okay. <laughs> Have a good night. Good evening. We are here at the Cape Pendleton High School for the Jazz Festival. Um, it's raining outside, but everything's good. We're here. We're about to go in, take our seats, and hopefully we can bring you a little bit of that. Um, the show. So stay tuned. Peace. This is the, as I said, the Cape Henlin 
High School Performing Arts Center where the Saturday Night Jazz All-Star Festival for Rehoboth Beach Jazz Festival is taking place. As you can see, there's plenty of seating around. They have some vendors that are selling um, products, jewelry, and art as well. And um, so yeah, a nice space. As I said, seating for you to wait until the show starts or when the show starts. So yeah. Okay, so Q and I are in our seats. We got our seats late, but this is a pretty decent view of the stage. We're in row X. <laughs> As you can see, we had to go up these steps of the riser, but a pretty decent view of the stage. Good evening, everyone. We are all settled in our seats at the Kate Hanlon High School for the Jazz Rehoboth Beach Jazz Festival All Star Concert. Do you want to add anything? It's raining outside, but we're good. Yeah, we're good. The seats are pretty decent. We are up on a like a riser. We got our seats late, but um, I'm not I'm not mad about it. Let me just flip it around. The, this is our van, vantage point from our seats, so we're like above everyone is sitting down there. So we're good with that. I think it's, I think it's better actually sitting up and on the floor. That's it is, it is. So I'm really, really pleased with the seating that we got. So I'm um, hopefully we can bring you a little bit of the show. If not, just we can, we, we will. We, we, we'll provide some snippets. <laughs> so um, as always, we thank you for watching and look for the snippets. We.
Good evening, everyone. Good evening. We have just wrapped up the All Star Jazz concert at the um, Cape Henlon High School Performing Arts. And, and my girl Mesa got down. Yes, she did. Oh my God, Mesa was absolutely wonderful. But so was Nick Coleone and Marion Meadows and Jackie Joyner and Peter White and Brian Simpson. That was unexpected. Peter White came out. Yes, it was. It was absolutely wonderful. That concert was wonderful. It's just that it was at Cape Hennepin Performing Arts, so that was like up the road and it the was raining. Yeah. yeah, the high school. So it, was, it wasn't quite a distance, but it was like 10, 15 minutes away from where we are now. But um, it was a really nice concert, so that kind of made up for it. So we're going to wind up this evening, and um, we have some footage of that. You should have seen it before this. And um, we're going to wind up our weekend here at Rehov Jazz Festival and we want to thank you if you're still with us for joining us. We appreciate it. QNS Vlogs, like, subscribe, comment, and we appreciate you watching us. We really do. But when you subscribe to us, you allow us to bring you even more content and we have more stuff coming. We have a couple of cruises coming up. We have a Disney World trip coming up. We have more jazz shows coming up. So please stay tuned if you like all those things. And if you don't, just take a look at it. It may change your mind. Anything else to say, Q? No. I want you to go enjoy yourself also. Exactly. Just like we do. Yes. So with that, we're winding up our evening. We're saying thank you for watching and we appreciate you. Peace. Good morning, everyone. We are on our way home. Um, we had a really nice weekend here. Uh, the concerts were wonderful. Uh, Eric Darius and Damian Escobar were exceptional. The um, all-star jazz um, show was exceptional. And the Boney James show, of course, was exceptional. So we had a nice weekend. It rained a little bit last night, but this morning is clear and bright and beautiful. Q and I are on our way home. We want to thank you all for joining us. And please, like, subscribe, and comment.